Hi everyone, I'm James and welcome to my YouTube channel. Knitwear is an absolute staple when it comes to autumn and winter. The thickness of materials used in knitwear gives you a combination of heat retention and breathability. This allows you to stay warm without getting overheated and sweaty. Knitwear also has a great look to it as well. Jumpers and cardigans in particular can have a really nice shape to them that can give you that boxy silhouette if that's what you're into. Plus, knitwear introduces different textures into your outfit, which is great when layering. In today's video, I'm partnering with Uniqlo to show you off some of my favorite pieces in their knitwear collection. I'll go through each piece in detail and then show you what they look like on body. For reference, I'm 5 foot 10, around 140 pounds, and I'll leave links to everything I'm wearing down in the description box. The first item is going to be a perfect base layer piece, and that's the 100% merino wool turtleneck jumper. I've always seen merino wool pieces and just assumed that they're a good thing because they usually come with a slightly higher price tag. But what actually is merino wool? Well, according to my very limited research, regular wool can be made up of the hair of various animals such as sheep, goats and rabbits. But merino wool is derived specifically from merino sheep, which are found primarily in Australia and New Zealand. Merino wool has a finer texture than regular wool, so it has a more luxurious, flexible and less itchy feel to it. And I can confidently say that this piece fits that description. This has a very soft feel to it, which is really comfortable against the skin. Although it's called a jumper, I would class it more as a long sleeve t-shirt because it's very thin. As already mentioned, it's very suitable as a base layer due to its comfort and warmth. Plus the turtleneck can peek out at the top, which adds a point of interest and sophistication to any outfit. I picked this up in a size large and I actually think it's a tad too big for me. Although I generally prefer a more relaxed look, this is just a little bit looser on me than I would have liked. So if you're around the same size as me, I would recommend going for a size medium. Okay, next piece, and if you were late to the recent Uniqlo U menswear drop, then listen up. This is your chance to pick up one of the most sought out pieces that sold out very fast, and that's the lamb's wool cardigan. The only caveat is that this is actually the women's version. However, I have both the men's and the women's version, and I can tell you there is very little difference between the two. The only differences that I can actually think of are firstly, the choice of color, Second, the women's version has pockets whereas the men's doesn't, but actually having pockets is a great addition in my opinion, and that was one of my only downsides of the men's version. And thirdly, as with all women's garments, the buttons are on the opposite side, but this is a very minor inconvenience. This is still made from the same chunky, high quality lamb's wool with ribbed detailing, and it has the same beautiful oversized body and cropped length which gives you that boxy look. I picked this up in the color brown and it's the most autumnal brown you can get. It has a lot of orange in it so it's very well suited to this season. I'm wearing this cardigan in a size large whereas I got the men's version in a size medium. They both fit very similar so if you're the same size as me I'd recommend going for a large. Overall this is one of the nicest quality and best fitting cardigans you can get for under £50 in my opinion. Cardigans are a fantastic mid layer underneath any sort of coat or jacket. This is something I went into in detail in my last video, so if that interests you, check it out. Next up is the souffle mock neck jumper in the colour beige. Anyone who has followed this channel for a bit will know my obsession with mock necks. The mock neck is a collar that fits closely to the neck and rides up slightly, but not as much as a turtleneck. The result brings a much more structured and elevated look to any outfit, versus a regular collar in my opinion. Now this is called a souffle jumper because the texture is light and fluffy like the dessert. It has a voluminous waffle knit which is seriously soft and comfortable. It honestly feels like the jumper is hugging you, it's so cozy to wear. On top of that, I think it has a really nice shape that very much suits my style at the moment. It has a relaxed cut and drop shoulders and I like to roll up the hem as well just to give me that extra boxiness. I picked it up in a size medium and it fits me like a glove. I think I could have gone with a large if I wanted a slightly more relaxed look and it still would have fit me well without looking too oversized. This jumper comes in a range of neutral colours which are really versatile when layering because they go with pretty much anything. 
So next, I picked up the Lamb's World Turtleneck Jumper. Unlike the Merino Turtleneck I showed off earlier, this one is definitely more of a jumper because it's thicker and heavier. Although it's not too thick, I'd class it as a mid-weight piece. Therefore, it's much more suitable as a mid-layer and you can definitely wear a t-shirt or vest underneath this. This has a different fit to the merino turtleneck as well. It's got shorter sleeves and also a shorter length body. And of course, as the name says, it's made from the same high quality lamb's wool that that cardigan was. This is a super premium feeling piece. The fit, construction and materials just feel spot on. I went for a size medium and I'm really happy with how it fits me. I think you can wear this untucked or tucked in. Because of that mid-weight fabric, it's not gonna create a bulkiness when it's tucked in. This will allow you to split your outfit up and create a bottom heavy look if that's what you're after. Overall, I just love the style the turtleneck gives you. It's casual but classy. If you haven't tried one before, now is the time because they are most suited to autumn and winter. Okay, and last up is going to be the Souffle Half Zip Jumper. As you can guess, this is made from the same material as that Souffle Mock Neck Jumper earlier, but it doesn't have the waffle knit pattern. But you're still getting that mega soft and comfortable feel. It's hard to believe that this isn't made from 100% wool because it feels so high quality. But the advantage of it not being 100% wool is that they can keep the price down. And this comes in at just under £35, which is an absolute steal in my opinion. The half zip is a wonderful design for layering in the colder weather. You can have it zipped all the way up for maximum warmth, which will give you that turtleneck layering effect underneath the top layer, or you can unzip it to cool down and have that base layer showing. As usual, Uniqlo did not skimp on the hardware, so you've got nice smooth YKK zippers. Just like the souffle mock neck jumper, I picked this up in a size medium, but I definitely could have got away with a size large if I wanted that more relaxed look. And so that's all I have for you today. Thank you to Uniqlo for partnering with me on this. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you found it useful. If you've got any questions, feel free to leave me a comment. I reply to everyone. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you next week.